Hey guys, it's Wowman Jacob, and we're back in Hearthstone. Um, we have 210 gold, which I will use to do arena an arena at some point. Um, but what we will do for now is I'm going to play another game. Uh, I'm going to choose a different class, and I'll show you some of the board mechanics. So. Hmm. Like I said, I'm a fan of the Warlock. Um, hmm, what should we choose? Mages are just annoying when you're battling against them, but I never seem to win with one. Um, so that's a problem. Priests are quite good. Hmm. But I think I'm going to go for the Warrior. Because I've played a few more games with him since I got him up to level 10. And I won them. Obviously. Well, you know. Um, so yeah, we'll have a look. When it's family and opponent. Oh, uh, that's not good. Let's try again. Might have to restart the client, perhaps. Um... Yes. Gonna connect me this time? Yes, it is. Oh, so we're batting against the mage. Uh, mages are annoying because I have uh, cards that will deal like six damage that they can use later on. Um, they also have the little um, fireball as their ability, and generally, when you put down like that, that's a good card, but it only has one health. Uh, it has charge and three attack, but they could take that out straight away just with the fireball. They don't even need to use like a proper card from their hand, which is annoying. Um, so, I'm happy with these cards. We have no one or two um, mana cards, but what we can do is... Oh, we're going second anyway, so we can start off with two mana, which I might use to armor up. Either that, or I can play... No, no, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do that. Or I could fiery war axe, but I think I'm going to armor up. Let's see what Slava... 095 does. Five cards, right. <clears throat> That's their ability, which is deal one damage. Uh, my one, as I said, is like armor up, which is gain two armor. And as I said in my last video, the armor acts are like health, it's like extra health it, that can stack above the actual health of the hero. Um, mm, let's do that. Take that out. Just so he doesn't keep hitting me with the minion. So yeah, during the beginning of games, it's quite slow. Um, and yeah, I was going to talk about the map. So there's different types. This one's the Orgrimmar map. Um, I believe there is a uh, Stranglethorn Veil map, for you, those of you who play WoW. And I think there's, yeah, there's a Pandaria one. And there's also one that escapes my mind. Um, so I'll just have my turn, then I'll show you what you can do. Alright, and then... Do that. So, I mean, it's fully interactive, this map. You can flick the sand, um, and you can, for instance, like, hit different parts of the map, and it does stuff around the edges. Like that. Mess with the grate on there. You can flick the um, I don't know vine, I suppose. Uh, I think that's it for over here. Uh, what do I want to do now? Got three attack. Take that out straight away with that damaging that. We could do. Hmm. I think I would like to. No, let's let's match him. Let's match him. And see what he does. So down here, you can pick up a rock, which is pretty cool. If you take it outside of the area, though, it will like get destroyed. But you can put it in the catapult and fire the catapult, and then wind it back again and do it again. So that's cool. Um.
And if you listen out, you can hear the guy getting hit on the other side as well. When it lands, mess with the banner. You can do that. So these are fun little things you can do to pass the time while you're waiting for them to have their turn. Because some people just take forever to take their turn. They almost run out of, turn, uh, out of time. That's either because, you know, they're spending ages thinking, or they've, like, nipped to the toilet and back. Um, so, yeah. Let's see what I can do. What I might do, this would be a good play. Attack that, and then use my execute to destroy a damaged minion. So if he attacks, he'll get destroyed. But it's a harvest golem, which has a death rattle to summon a 2-1 damaged golem. Um, so he will summon another one. Therefore, I'd like to have... Other stuff up as well. Unless I just attack him with. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. And then. Still got two attack, but one health. I think I'd just like to put some armor on for now. See, now if that. If he had been down to one health. Um, he slash she could have just taken the minion out with the fire blast, which would have been really annoying. I have a feeling she might fire blast me now, straight to my face, because that's just okay. some free attack you can do. Oh, well, not. She just wants to put something strong down. Okay. I might also do that. That will survive an attack from that as well, which is quite nice. I won't attack because. I can just take it out with my minion, because he's going to attack me anyway, because I have to attack him, I can't attack past. So, he's going to attack me, and rather than taking damage twice, because if I attacked it, it wouldn't have died, because I only, I have three um, attack and as five health, so I would have taken two lots of damage. Oh, damn. Polymorphed, turned it into a 1-1 one, one sheep, and then took it out with the arcane explosion. That was a good play right there. So I'm really going to need to do something. I don't think I'm going to be able to survive against the mage. Although, she only has one card left. So if I can get rid of these, I'm in quite a good position. Because it's all about how many cards you have left. Really. That's why I like playing the Warlock. Okay. Um, I'm going to do this. Yes. And then... That. Two. I can either Murloc or no, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm going to Murloc. Although that was probably a bad play because she can just fire blast it. Because he's obviously gonna take it out unless she has something that she can do to take it out instead. No, nope, you can't do that. Oh you can. My bad. I thought the fire blast had to attack the taunt, but clearly not. I know that if you if you um, if your character has an attack, i.e. if you like equip a weapon and such, um, then you have to attack the taunt. But I totally forgot that the fire blast you can attack past, which is quite annoying. Huh. <sighs> mhm. Mm yeah, I'm just gonna leave it. Otherwise, he's probably going to attack me directly with the Boulder Fist Ogre. Handle it. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. Yeah, the minions have plus one attack. No, you have to go for that one. Which he's probably going to do. So he can save both of his. Well, he can keep the last one alive with as, most, uh, as much health as possible. Yes, go on, fire blast me. But you have no minions left, so hopefully I can make a comeback from this. Hmm, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, excuse me, eight, nine. Or oh, armor. Armor, I think. That's all I can do. So I at least I have four minions out. Though he's probably going to get attacked straight past. So 5 health. Two, I'll probably do 2 for 5. Oh, or not. Okay, so that was quite good for him. For it to attack those minions. Because it's random. Uh, 
Okay, so not going so well. I haven't even taken one damage off the enemy hero. I need to do something pronto. Haha, -ha, taunt. And I can trade that down and I can have the armor. Two, four. Mm. There's no point doing it quite yet. Because he'll probably just attack that with something anyway. And then have... Hmm. I'm probably going to regret this, but I'm not going to attack. Hmm. What's he going to do? Okay. Two for five. Hmm. And then we're off. Oh, Freaking out. Okay, I've lost. No. Uh, uh, so I mean, that's one of the shorter games I've had. I mean, I've had games where I've won like on the seventh turn. Um, let's play another one, so I can show off another hero and ha hopefully have another map as well. Hmm. So let's play as the mage, so you can see a bit more of what the mage actually can do. Do 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 do. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Ah. Oh. <sighs> we'll find someone soon. I mean, there's not that many people playing in the EU at the moment, but it hasn't taken too long in the past, but it's taking a bit longer now. Jaina versus Thrall. Jacob F versus Jair, J-R. Mm. Too early on. Too early on. Mm, probably too early on, but it depends what other cards I get. Mm, okay. Polymorph. Oh, I get it back anyway. Sucks. Murdoch Raider. What you gonna do? Well, he's probably gonna coin and then totemic call or something like that. Oh, or nothing. Okay, just don't don't do anything. I'll have some free hits on you then. Three health down. Can't really have done anything else. Cause I only had two mana crystals this turn, and everything costs more. But luckily, my fire blast only costs two. Now this is when I can just fire blast that. It's probably the best play. Otherwise, he's going to take out my Murloc. Yes, it was a mistake, but it stopped me from bringing out my raid leader or my Sh Senjin shield master. Well, no, not my Senjin, um, or my Wolf Rider. Rather, because I only had three mana crystals. Uh huh. Wrath of Air Totem, spell damage plus one. Hmm. Can give it some attack. Well, that was pointless. You gave it some attack this turn, and then it lost. <laughs> uh, that was a mistake. Um. <laughs> You know what, it's got no attack. Let's just attack a little, with a little bit more this turn. I think this guy seems quite new to playing a shaman, to be fair. That's probably going to be the taunt one. Yep. Wind Fury, oh god. Two. What? No, wait. One. Oh, now you're going to Rock Fighter. Well, clearly what I've got to do here is... Oh, wait. Hmm, that might work that out really mistake. well. Or it might not. Depending. Oh, wait, mm, I could use that later on. Well yes, thank you. Um, that, and then I've got Wolf Rider, which can attack this turn. 
So yeah, down to 19. Because like I say, um, the mage is really annoying because it has so many different things it can do. Um, like the polymorph is a free like... So let's say that's got like 6 health, I can just get rid of the 6 health. And the taunt. That was a mistake. Yes it was. And then I can just fireball it. So you've got so many utility based things as a mage, it's really good. And like I can arcane missile rather than wasting these characters by getting their um, like health to zero by attacking. Which is quite cool. Oh it's a healing one. But that's not going to do you much good unless you can attack with something this turn and have it with one more, with at least one health at the end of the turn. So yeah, that sucked for him. And I'm going to use arcane missiles now. Oh, imp master. Hmm. Let's hope that the this these arcane missiles can do one, two, three damage in that order. Oh, I've got another one as well. Okay, good. It's good to get that one's health down because it can summon a 1-1 one, one minion and it will cost a health. So that means it can only summon 3 more minions. Um, let's do that again. That was a mistake. Okay, that worked out. Alright, it could have worked out better. And then we will chuck down a taunt so that we can keep attacking with that attack. Doesn't look like he can do much at the moment unless he has a utility card or he has something with um, charge. Because he really needs to take out my taunt. Otherwise, he's going to go down. So he's probably going to do three or f oh or that. At least um, the shaman. Uh, give you a taunt as there, because I mean it's the same as polymorph, except from polymorph is a one-one without taunt. But at least in this case, they can they give you a taunt, which is better for me. Which you can't really do much with one attack anyway. Hmm. Okay. Then what? What card have you got? Oh, you're just gonna attack. Looked like he was trying to put a card down. But... Uh, five, six, seven, eight, three, six. Oh, I can get him down really low here. If only I had a fire blast, then I could have finished him off. But I didn't quite. He's gonna have to get rid of them. Three, four, one. He could get rid of them. But I could just fire blast him next turn, so I'm probably going to win, considering I've got full health moment. Go on, do something. Oh, good. Still, you can't really do much. 612. Um. Okay. Well, I've won. Your opponent left. Oh well, you can go die anyway. I've never seen that happen before. Your opponent left. You can concede and just have it end, but I've never seen them, never seen that pop up um, come up and actually still let me play. Gold earned. Forty. Destroy forty minions. And we still had the old Grimmar board, so I couldn't really show you anything new. In this case. Quest log. I have no more quests. I will get another one tomorrow. Um, I actually haven't been playing in ranked mode. You can choose if you can going ranked or unranked. I'll probably just change it over to ranked now. But then again, I haven't actually got that many cards, so I can't create like an awesome deck yet. I don't think I've got many more than when I showed you last. But doing this um, arena run that we'll do. Probably next time will give us some more cards to play with. Actually, let me go and show you for a sec the legendary cards. Wait, crafting mode. Include soulbound. 
Mm -mm 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 -mm. I mean, legendary cards, they're not like you can automatically win the game. I remember playing Yu-Gi-Oh. Yes, I was more of a Yu-Gi-Oh than a Pokemon boy, but um, in that you could just like summon a legendary god card and then just pretty much, you know, win straight away. But in this, they have um, interesting, um, if I could find one, interesting abilities. So like... Leroy Jenkins summons two 1-1 one, one whelps for your opponent, which seems kind of pointless unless you have charge, because they're just going to take him out anyway. Or you have a um, a torn open. Uh, what else is there? Old Murkai. That works well in, obviously, a Murloc deck. Mm, what else is there? No, no. Ah, Captain Greenskin. Give you a 1-1 one, one weapon. So they're just little extra things that they do. Harrison Jones. Destroy your opponent's weapon and draw cards equal to its durability. Uh, Sylvanas. That's an interesting one. That's actually quite a good card to have, in my opinion. Um, that's another good one. Uh, Illidan, the Beast. Hmm, it's all right. Baron Geddon. If you're winning, that's quite a good card. Unless your opponent can make a comeback. Destroy an enemy with minion with taunt. That's awesome. Actually, I don't remember seeing the Black Knight card until recently. Also tells you who uh, did the artwork as well, by the way. And for gold cards, the animation is... Well, it's an animation as opposed to just a picture, which is pretty cool. Grrrl... Uh, Ragnaros... Um, Alexstrasza... Which is a cool card, unless they have less than... 15 health, and in that case you'll have to lower or heighten your health to 15. Nosdormu, ah, that's the card I was talking about where players only have 15 seconds to take their turns. Which is quite frantic, honestly. But then it's the, the target for their attacks, really, because they want to get rid of it as soon as possible. Now that's a cool one as well, unless they have an AoE ability. Mm, Ysera, Deathwing... See, no, that's not a legendary. These last few cards are really, are really interesting, actually. Okay, so that's been episode two. I will see you again next time. See you later. Bye.